Hello, this is Kia from Zenforo. In the Have You Seen posts we've produced so far for Zenforo 1.4, we've demonstrated ways to help you run your forums more efficiently with new tools like our automated bounce email handling and improvements to our anti-spam measures. We've shown you features that allow administrators to create content, like the custom help pages feature, and improved your ability to monetize your forums with enhanced user upgrade management tools. We've given your SEO a boost with our implementation of the Sitemap XML standard and brought previously buried content to the forefront with our improvements to our profile post interface. Arguably, however, it's those features that improve the posting experience for your users that are most important for your forums. And while we've already shown you some improvements to polls earlier this month, today I'm going to show you a new feature that we've been working on that may just change the way you reply to messages completely. I'm going to start off by showing you a fairly extreme example of the old way of doing things that shows what's wrong with it. Here we've got a user who's posted a large message. Uh, it's actually taken straight from Wikipedia and their definition of an internet forum. And I'm going to play the role of a user who wants to reply to this last sentence on most forums users do not have to log in to read existing messages. What would normally happen is that uh, we'll hit the reply button and we'll quote the entire post and then say something along the lines of So I've replied to the post and we've got the entire content of the previous post in this quote box. Now we didn't have to do that, um, we could have done this instead and uh, gone into here and edited and deleted. And that's a lot better, but that was quite a lot of work. Wouldn't it be nice, though, if I could just select the text I want and quote it? Well, with Zenfora 1.4, you can do exactly that. Let's start off by selecting this text here. And as soon as I release the mouse button, I get a quote text prompt. I click it, and it's quoted exactly as I selected it. There are various safeguards built in to make sure you can't select bits that aren't allowed. So you can't select across messages. That won't bring up the prompt, but any valid selection will bring up the prompt to allow you to quote it. It can deal with formatting, so I can grab hold of uh, links, images, smileys, and all sorts of bits and pieces like that, and quote those, and it will just keep on building up our, our, our quote system under here. There's another way of replying to messages, which is multi-quote. Uh, let's get rid of that and go and take a look at multi-quote very quickly. Let's turn that on and go and have a look at this thread here, which has got some small posts. And you'll note that the multi-quote control has appeared. So in the normal course of things, we would select the messages we want to quote, hit the insert quote button, and uh, get ready to quote them. But again, we've taken the entire content of all of those posts. So let's say we don't want to do that anymore. Let's say now, we want to just take small bits of each post. So let's do that. Let's take the first post, add that to the multi-quote. Let's take this and add that to the multi-quote. You'll notice that my computer is responding really slowly here because I'm recording the screen. Uh, it actually works a lot faster than this in real life and it's being quite frustrating to record. And let's have the whole of that. You'll notice I'm doing this. Uh, that I've taken snippets from each of these posts and uh, they've lit up the multi-quote button. Uh, I'm not limited to a single snippet from each post. Uh, let's actually grab another one from there and let's just keep going. Um, I can remove all of those quotes by just taking off the multi-quote button. Uh, this one down here, you remember I didn't make any selections, I've just clicked the multi-quote button, it'll take the whole post. Let's go and take a look at them in the insert quote dialog. And there they are. So this came from the first post, as did that. And uh, needless to say, because it's integrated into the multi quote system, we can drag and drop as if they were entire posts. Hit the quote button 
and there's all my snippets in one go. Ta-da!